Hey everybody, Languages Lover here and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to make a review on the Lonely Planet phrasebook for Hungarian, so stay tuned. But first, as always, quick reminder, hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell icon to get notified for every new video that I upload. And let's get right into this Magyarl phrasebook review. So, as you can see, the book covers looks really nice. They're playing chess in the pool, so that's really cool. I'm gonna move over here. Let me just do this. They're gonna get a spine for Hungarian. Really cool. This is an older edition. Yeah, this is the second edition. So this one is not really old. The first one being released in 2005. So that. So yeah, and they released it seven years later. Okay, so. You actually get an idea of how often they release the Hungarian one or how often they renew it so so as always for every Lonely Planet phrase book you have these survival phrases over here Servus, Servus Tok Sias, Sias Tok Edge and etc you have me, myself and I <laughs> meaning that there are cases I like how they did it because, you know, like me, myself, I, or like, I know they're not considered cases in English, but there are different forms of the same word, which is I. I, me, myself, yeah. So, you get the point. Over here, they can actually call that Hungarian has 22 cases, but. I think there's a lot of miscomprehension of as to how many cases exactly there are in Hungarian, but some say that there are 18, like I have heard, and I've also heard something that there were there were 20, 35 with the, all the the clenches on cases and prepositions. So yeah, so I'm still unsure about how many cases Hungarian has. But if you're an advanced speaker and you, well, actually, I do know that one Hungarian was actually watching my channel. Because he actually commented on my top 10 most difficult language videos. So, could you tell me how many cases are in Hungarian? That would be super awesome. And also, that sometimes Hungarian has a different sentence structure. Sometimes it does, but it's not always the same. Like I for, yeah, right here, for example, say it's, mm -mm, you say, mm -mm, vajok. so it's, for example, an apple, it's an apple, apple, it's, literally, so, that's why it's always important to learn a sentence structure in the language, so. I just like the sounds of Hungarian. Although it is a very huge challenge, I like it a lot. So for example, over here you have a politics section, social issues. Who do you vote for? Alright, I still hope you can see you well. As I'm showing you, don't call down bees. Der Reis. It's actually Royce. Like I said, very awesome pronunciation, but yeah. You also have your dictionary, which is English to Hungarian, and the blue one, you have Hungarian to English. So, yeah, this was my review on the Hungarian Facebook massive uh, Lonely Planet, sorry. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you have, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, that'd be super awesome, amazing, and I'll see you next time. Bye!